I am probably probably a day off. I'm like several things off on this. And that's because my current to be set set is I'm having a good time trying to charge up in general. So I'm testing out my other headsets, which should be working just fine, but Discord is being a massive requisite, so either that it's my internet being used at once or it's just things happening. We shouldn't be far now. Yes, yeah, just through the cane in the head, we'll be on chance to have his doorstep. Ugh, if I don't think we can take a civilized rest. You almost make it sound as if you've done a lick of work. It only gets harder from you, dear brother. Does the matter of the frenzied feeds when answer to refugees not to not domestic formally declare the face for gender? I should take up plates rather too for to be slacking. It's all very good to say, but surely spending every moment friendly gives it the answer either. I stay west while we still. What the devil was that? A pack of fiends has appeared, sir. They've blocked the ship's path and are preparing to flank us. It seems the time for Westing has already passed. I'll go and call for the path. We both are a bit eager to the defenses, despite duty as waterborne of royal blood. Can't be all of us, Alex. We're going to get him. Wait, are you including me? I just think you'd be ch camping, camping to expect to lead people of Bansback to do an emperor ship, and I move. Well, yes, yeah, yeah, but uh, wait a moment. I'm not emotionally prepared. No, leave it behind. <laughs> I love him, you uh, The development he's getting is so good. The situation is grave, my liege. We must act swiftly. The fiend's picture was Black Monaco even more violent, and Alberia's largest cities are all attacked at once. Tempting as it is to frame it all, I simply need to remove the wastes of the progenitor's return. I fear there's more at play here. My liege? Though whoever defends you by Black Monaco, the fiends thus far have been just that, by a beast acting on animal instinct. But this latest attack is clearly different. Timing, location, the small distribution of forces, it's all too strategic to be instinct. Is the progenitor controlling them? No, according to some intelligence, he still hasn't moved from Grams. What's more, the reports don't paint him as the sort of part of forming a strategy just to be rid of us. When that's the case, who is guiding the frenzied fiends? Conjecture won't lead to any answers. You, gotta be something at once. I know what is the idea of turning to them for ages, but we we'll haven't the time for our pride. We offer you. Yes, your highness. <sighs> this is gonna be a headache. That takes care of this area. Now all that remains is. Eep! Why should I have to endanger myself with this lunacy? Stand back, Mio. Ha! Ah! Oh, a dragon fell in a single blow! <laughs> what had they flee before us? Who spot a fairy than I say? We've nothing to fail! Ah, uh, indeed. But you tuned in nothing but fiends and dragons, that may well have been the case. So you've noticed as well. Huh? Uh, notice what? Just so I can be sure you're talking about this anything I noticed. I suspect that was the scouting force meant to gate off to Someone is controlling them from the shadows. Seeing as they timed their attack just as we entered the canyon, I'll put on cleaning notes of terrain here well. Blocked four and a half by fiends and by walking wall on either side where you would have no choice but to fight. If you ain't any but smart. Ah, uh, uh, yeah, so it was the same thing I was just about to bring up. Right, so. Um, I did report! I didn't enough to require shining it? Well, what is it? Yes, ma'am. His sign is near asked that all members of the Avarian Royal family gather at the heart of them at once. You have noticed what's going on as well, then. If it's that urgent, I don't suppose we have time to stop our chance earlier first. 
No! I was so ready to finally get a proper weapon, Chancellor! And enough belly aching. Back aboard the plane for your now, March. We leave at once. Ugh, fine. This doesn't bode well. That's most of us, at least. Everyone but Yudin and Zephyr, though, that's hardly a surprise. Those two are up in Gantos' old stomping grounds, the desert of Moscow's day is the eastern edge. I said the Grand Fjord there, but they will be around yet before the rise. That ship and the Hound are linked by your various legacy. That advice will be transported in here directly. <sighs> I'm not relying on people who may never actually turn up. On to the matter at hand. A few days ago, all of our previous great cities came under attack from Fiend's Frenzy by Block Bond and Tins. Until then, they operated on instinct to start strategy or coordination. This is something altogether different. You saw clear intention into attack. Any ideas as to what to do after? Their target is the Iberian Royal Line. Us. Oh, wait! Us! Why? What did we ever do? You just decided to talk to some deep connect to the Iberian Crown. This wasn't just some random violence. It was a clear de declaration of war. But, but why come out the worst? What possible reason could. More than you could count. The far more important question now is how to deal with this approaching threat. I assume that at the point you've asked us here, you've already had something in mind, and that is. Obviously, I've prepared a warm reception for the enemy, but that requires them to show up. Bringing you all here was the simplest means to ensure that they target to have them. True, it's much simpler to come up with a joint response here than if we spread out and didn't know who'd be targeted when. Agreed. Force go find out a well fortified location is a great strategy. But depending on the speed, we could be surrounded. The enemy's numbers are comparatively few. You saw that in the force that we laid you. So before they can circle our. Ugh, I can't follow the conversation at all. That's not a sentiment you voice loud of you. Oh, please, it's fine. I don't understand what I don't understand. My policy is to leave these matters to those who do. Why well, don't any responsible policy, isn't it? Though I suppose in this case, I can't say I disagree. None of us can do everything alone. If our expertise is the first, we ought to dedicate each manager to the appropriate expert. Agreed. A wise king must know when to defer to others, though it takes courage to admit it. To rely on others to admit we lack the ability ourselves, after all. An especially difficult task for so called gifted ones. Indeed. Ironically, it may be the best suited to rule among all of us. Wait, you two are praising me? <laughs> it seems my time has finally come! The Emil era starts today! Quiet down, fool. No one is saying a king has license for ignorance of the law. Very true. We all have King Iberius as a model, too. Though we may fall oh, short, we are ought to at least aspire to share his ideals. Uh, but Iberius always makes for such unflattering comparison. Even Father once warned me not to choose Iberius as my Lord Lord Thor. No strong king would know, only isolation. The king must never stand alone, he said. And the face may have been for his own benefit as much as yours. One was never the type to take on everything himself. But the world needed a hero of Alberius' statue at the time. I suspect you may need one now as well. Were he alive today, I would dearly like to see how King Alberius would forge order from these chaotic times. Were Alberius alive? An interesting thought. I cannot disagree more. Hypotheticals are meaningless. The ways of this hour are not in the same dead hero's hand, but in ours. How to rule our lands, how to face our foes, or force on us to decide these things, and none other. I will require you to serve some purpose as well, Emil. If you would claim to hold any qualities of leadership, show them now. Uh, I know, it, it may have been a stroke of luck that landed on me to throw but even I have managed to further war adequately. Whatever I must do, I shall see it done! Ah, stay back! The next day. <laughs> ah, watch it. What are you doing? What was that brief glimpse of courage from yesterday gone? The Anitas. The enemy are still coming. If your words then will not lie. Now it's time to prove it. Fine, fine, I'll prove it. It's no secret that I've been a short time, but I've got 
I've got a horde of minions, so of course, fiends and dragons alike under the seal of great numbers. Onward, my warriors of the Daemon army. All unit forward, march! Looks like that's even Amir was putting in an effort this time. Yes, we can't get. Oh, letting him show us up. Indeed, I will muster every ounce of might I possess to lay ruin to the fourth block for me. I thought, it's been a while since we've seen you, like, ever. Come, witness the Fulminator's fury! Ha! Well, are you waiting to turn before the all survive the Emperor Meal? Hmm? Damn it, fuck! You go to up! What's the problem, people? What is happening? It seems a separate force has been advancing through the Fogged Secret. This area seems large temperatures. See large temperature swings from day to night this time of year, which gives life in fog. They use that. Ugh, this isn't good. The pincer attack is sapping on numbers. We're losing the advantage. Huh? So why do they have a sandwich? We were absolutely up in the floors a moment ago. Don't go on chicken on me now, not over this. Get in there and fight! Attack and attack and attack till they're all dead! Oh dear. Seems this one's supposed to be correct us for valor. Excuse me, who is this guy? <laughs> I'm about to step out of the front lines alone. Go, you lord, all you need to attack. Why about this more good off that fool's face? Soldiers of the Demon Empire, eh? It's nice new car to hold back. Us. My sorry, what he shape shifted? Hmm, how amusing. Has to lay bare whatever to earn their Apollo trick he's using. I'll see your bones reduced to ass. Fall our chemical burst. Huh, not a grand end for a charlatan. Not a bad technique, but your judgment is questionable. Wait a moment. <laughs> Impossible, he shapes it into a second- ah! Not just a sixth system, but the master of multiple Pac-Man dragons, like you did. Who are you? <laughs> Me? Alberius. Goddess, deliver me! Can you keep up with a goddess? I've got plenty of snacks packed for the trip. Princess Strength! Power, alchemy, and dragons together! This will buff my appetite too! I shall cleave the darkness and open the way. Immaculate wings. Yeah. Power wells within. <laughs> if only I had light mana cast the they had to be able to walk full of ammo cast. Right. When holding down on screen, but I don't. Faster. I got to sort of using an actual shouting unit. Time to Good fun. An impressive technique. Or any other unit that's not light. I shall cleave the darkness and open the way. I usher in a future most bright. They don't call me the goddess for nothing. Abirius? Like Abirius the founder? What? There's no way. He lost 300 years ago. No, that voice, that face, is a bit younger here, but just as I saw in the memories of Cla 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 Clave Loy Loon, that's him. Which means the real question is why? 
Cast you need to out the side. Be the hero of legend all my own blood and if there's any who stand in my path so far. A fine attack, but I don't know to strike me down, it seems. <laughs> That's not that can't be what the one who me and I don't have here in an instance! That was I see, so that's what this is. If you have any insights, I would welcome an explanation, but I suspect that it is one of the replicas used by the experiments I conducted back when I was a puppet of the progenitor. Experiments? Why would you go and make something like that? I had my reasons. Don't want to spare a puppet to extend the progenitor as well, for one. As the vessel able to contain that power, I required a replica to fit the one, which arrived the original, both physically and mentally. Though it appears the progenitor has used Black Martin to warp its mind to better suit his purposes. And this replica is faithful enough to give a shape shift? Yes, if we achieved with a modern model that after abuse his own shape shifting as to record in the memories of his battles. It isn't true shape shifting, strictly speaking, but the results and the phenomena it creates are no less potent than we all think. So great. Is that the thing even possible? I was fortunate enough to get my hands on the real thing after all. Real thing? <laughs> Leave Lawyer Luna. Correct. It was created from the remains of the Netherworld, merged into one with Alberius. The Netherworlds? Alberius remains. Then this truly is. I set out to recreate the strongest person in recorded history, but in the end I abandoned the project. Abandoned it? Then just what is that before us now, pray tell? The experimental subject I had destroyed, I should guess. But we are done awakened somehow. I suspect we have to block one of stirring and awaken the burden to return to thanks for its awakening. Still, I never thought to encounter it like this. It's a bit of food my effort have pushed aside. This one is this mine. Sorry, we're done talking. I'd like to continue, and I see one just right now. Hmm. <clears throat> Impudent lock off! Winnie really now, an attack like that won't stop me. Uh, do not mock me! This is a good. What a. Does the replica have some weakness? Surely there's some sort of countermeasure. That replica was born of all the world's memories of Arbuies, preserved in each of its monster parts. As I said, it is a mental and physical match for the real Arbuies. What's more, it can't be heard in the presence of Lagmana. And that's unreasonable! How am I to be a monster like that? However, it holds a coin as the stains and controls it. We were able to strike that core somehow. Where will we find this core? The left breath likes to see the for man's heart. If destroyed, the replica will be unable to maintain its form and fall apart. Ah, so we can win! In your correct optimism, what begins to be a zero of legend to just find him all and all is a tall order? I don't see what other choice we have. Come, let's join the Uniters. Just lovely. Come along then, no dawdling. Oh! Ah! Ah! You'll face me next! Hua! You've won fit to wife or walk in, but an attack that does connect with no threat. Ugh. Then what is this? Now! A nuisance. No, all of them together, and it still wasn't enough! That just leaves you. Are you just going to stand in? Uh, I won't be made a fool of. Uh, 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 that was just sad. Maybe in another few hundred years, kid. Damn you! Don't think this is over! We're not out of this yet! No, you've definitely lost. And this world is at its end. Oh, Alex! Ah! 
that capacity is passing limit from protecting another. You truly are being his descendants. You speak as if you really did have his memories inside you. Oh, I do. I've learned it all. Perhaps it's more accurate to say I know it. His travels was in the wind for to uh, rather the other. The founding of the kingdom where man and dragon can coexist. I knew everything that made Oberius the man he was. And what of it? When I was a boy, I loved listening to the tales of Alberius. I idolized him. Dreads of becoming a man in his image. The undefeated warrior, Fancus of the other, proud king and founder of Alberius. Hero who fought alone for his people. If you truly carry his memory so well inside you, how can you stand on that side of this battle? It's not too late to join us! Trying to talk me into defecting, awfully you cannot angry for a man who looks like a wall walking slab of muscle. That isn't my intention. I really don't want to see the noble idea of Alberius one held back through the mud by. Ridiculous. Noble ideals? What are you on about? I don't know what letters they filled your head with, but you understand nothing. What? I may only be a copy, but I hold a wheel of it as his memories is in me. So let me say the truth is you. What truth? I think it's just a man who happened to swing a sword a bit better than most. Undefeated? Huh, <laughs> he lost plenty of battles. He didn't become king because he wanted to, so he didn't feel a speck of pride about it. And he fought alone out of convenience. The hero you idolize is a false item made by centuries of Waisley and Bella's tales. Averus was not the man you think of. He just wanted to enjoy life. There was no lofty idea of grand purpose there. Don't go protecting your own ideas on others. Ah! It's over. Huh? Reinforcement, eh? Hi. Huh. You're late, you impudent insect. Sorry, it took us a while. I said, treat your wounds immediately, uh, Alex. <laughs> we came here fast from our mission! Ugh, much appreciated and stuff, yeah. Are you obeying warriors too, then? One of Abirius' descendants? Is... that Abirius? What now? It's the replica. Now I've skipped the details for now, but it's clearly not him. I think you see is our enemy. See, he's quite right. My first and mine may be recreations of Abirius's, but we are not the same. I am not a hero who would fight us toward the other, nor am I a his king. I am an existence whose purpose has been determined to destroy you and cross all possibility from this world with this power. So you claim to hold no free will or choices in you, a puppet whose two possibilities have been stolen by the progenitor then. Ugh, he's strong, but this is a fight we cannot lose. Dragons, bury your might! Safe shifting. Then I too will show you the power of the dragon blood. We need to help him. Ugh. Order, you can't. If you move in your condition, you'll tear your wound back open. Finding an athlete is a losing proposition. Judging for the situa situation, we need to fall back in the group. Retreat! And what? Hold up inside the Halidon? I doubt that's possible. I saw an army of feet advancing in the Highlanders' direction a short while ago. If we retreat in that direction, we'll be caught between the thing and them before we reach the castle. We won't survive it. Okay, so what do we do then? We only have one choice. Oh, another multiple pact order, then I have to stay on my toes. Take this! Weak! Now so, do it! I don't need you to tell me. Ugh, a smoke screen! Quickly, you know, we're retreating! Retreating? Then... We've no choice, we're abandoning the hell them. Alright, let's go.
slipped away, have they? No matter. My immediate goals are accomplished. And besides, we'll meet again soon enough. Man, this up is gonna store us long, huh, Faith? That's a good thing you made him, huh? Not that he made it specifically because of the gender, but God! Uh, things. The moon in here is suffocating. Can't care to be anywhere else. Uh, 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 uh. Alex! Oh, thank goodness you're okay. I'm sorry when you lost consciousness with retreat. This is the good city of Wolvertail, south of the Hall of them. They were kind of to lend us a useful wound. Sophia, you didn't. Any of you. What is the situation? Worse than bad. And after we were through, we received word that the Hall of them has fallen to the enemy. Now, previous in the block, Mondafeeds have taken it for the wrong so I'm going to remain there now. And now it's the creator and the crux of all our efforts, seeing it's only way so easily as those massive blow them morale. It was a stark defeat. Small wonder the really moved a mix of grief over the hand of the spear at our war prospects. Now we'll claim the hand of whatever it takes. It's the cornerstone of any hopes of victory in this fight. That place is more than just a stronghold, and it's the scene of hope and peace of mind for all of us. We must have it back. What well, that's all well and good to say, but how do you plan to take it? I trust you're not just founding promises and not a plan? I may not have a concrete plan just yet, but I still need to make it clear to everyone that I've not given up. Oh, please, just don't expect me to short headlong to my death beside you. There's no point in finding it unless you can win. Not true, Neil. Even if our odds are grim, we still must fight. And citizens when he stood the hope could soon become desperate and the kingdom will fall from his end. We must sort of all the hope is not lost. Such as our duty is worthy to protect the people. Audible soul of the threat comes from one who serves our blood. Uh, and I suppose that's and that's real, but. Oh? I feel pointing me away is extremely reasonable. I'm walking on a lot of fine lacks elegance. I have little concern for elegance, but I mean I was correct to state that fighting a losing war is meaningless. Do not mistake me, I'm merely saying not to fight with the intention of losing. So if we have to fight, do it under the assumption of victory. Obviously, we win or the future was lost. Failure is unacceptable. Why well, do you all intend to lose again? <laughs> so let's begin formulating our plan to grind that smug Earthside Zero into the dirt beneath our boots. So you were here, and you was worried. If one needs to touch the cover, I'm just always safe indeed if I put it like him working for me. Dabs about tomorrow's operation. We draw the enemy's attention while you didn't strike Siberius, a poetic bit of event for the Harrodom. We've crafted contingencies for everything from terrain to weather conditions down to the last detail. I have no doubts. Dissatisfactions then? Perhaps you wanted to be the one to face Siberius? I ignore himself but his skill. He has the blood, the strength, and the faith of the people. He's a true royal. Ah, yes, the three qualifications for a king, was it? And I recall you speaking of them when we were children. I was better than the Romska back then. You and the others were my only link to the world beyond my chamber door. The years of cursing my fate, fearing death's coming. But still, I burned with a hunger for my research to chase that faint hope. I've kept company with someone quite a hunger too long not to notice by then. You're biting your tongue about something. Perhaps you're right, but this is not a time for selfishness. Yuda was assigned the task of finding a be with my of my blessing and yours and all the others. Yes, but what are your true feelings? You have long signed your own voice to be an instrument in achieving others' designs. Might you not be tired to turn your eyes from the outward idea you seek to uphold and look inward? What's your hunger for? I do wish to face the hero I and my own seek to emulate, to find an honorable duel, one warrior against another. But what about you? Do you still think yourself the cause of all this? I expect your side stopped the previous is even greater than mine. Am I mistaken? I don't suspect suppose you are. But if you might say to me now, I have no intention of objecting to the plan. This is the correct choice at the war line. Alex, I only hope you're certain.
Final preparations are complete, my liege. The winning order, sir. Good. Did the operation we take to handle shall commence. Send up the starting fail. At once, sir. That's a fair. Look alive, people. It's Lady Sir. <laughs> They sent over the signal. Everything here was ready to go. Move out, man! The player has been fired. The plan is for us to move after the second. Right? Fairies? That's correct. Shaman and Valak should be commencing their attack now. Once the enemy mobilizes to meet them, they'll begin falling back, drawing the enemy to the Hallow of South and West. Yeah, once the defenses are threatened, it's certainly nice to be reflected the east and north. But where does this really work? Obviously, we can't explain that. Everything would go exactly the same, but... Oh, there's a second fear. It would seem things are going to plan so far, at least. Oh, right. In that case, time to move out, you lot! All of you, fall in behind me! A simultaneous strike from all defections. I think it's sort of realize this is a feint. But for that very reason, he should be reluctant to make a move before he knows where the real attack is coming from. Next is Yuna's unit, but I'm a bit concerned. We are seeing the troops well, as I head on an independent raid. It seems the fighting has begun. Yes, if things are going to plan, his forces should have been drawn out of the hand by now. Time. This is your will? Never find a mind ugly stones as a means of escaping emergencies. Might never thought to be using them as a way in. Come in everyone. The numbers of side castles reach them, but I believe should still be here to the status of four fronts. But take him out here and now. This is hard mercy. I believe he isn't here. This is not a very black model with the angel dragon side of. How is this successful ship is diverse and there's no rain and not a single enemy would be left in? Sophia, look out! Thank you, Yudin. A surprise attack? Is this... We're surrounded? But how do they react as quickly? An ambush. The weather strategy. The Liberia says... Did you think to find me just sitting about the castle? Not for being impatient for a story to hear, aren't you? I didn't think you were taking yourself off his bait. Sorry, but waiting around is never my style. In that case, we shall gladly take the hand in the back for you. I just thought the hero would be responded. Heh, <laughs> if you're able to provoke me by time, I'll disappoint you. I can hand you along and make it back within time span. You flatter yourself, but I know you're not just idle talk. But bad news, sir, Lady Shell and Leonidas are routed. The forces are retreating. What? What's the double already? And today when the army under Emperor Emil is all but wiped out, and this way our own forces will soon fall. Like my defense is free to the are formidable, but it shouldn't be possible for them to change the tide so quickly. Unless... I'm afraid so. Oblivious? Tore my forces out and needs to exit and strike me at the heart of us, and it? I'm ready to play Mr. Mark. I expect you've already heard, but I've crossed the other three. It's just you now. Have to move. You need to ask. I stand indomitable. I will eventually be releasing you. Don't be. Stand ready, sir. Ugh. 
it's over. Nothing you can do now would change the fact that you have no oh, chance of winning. No, not yet. This this fight isn't over yet. <sighs> I don't have the patience for this. Could the gap in our base be any clearer? As a member of the royal line, I have an obligation to protect the people. So it was not an option here, even if it kills me. As a royal, huh? I can see your place here finding birth and strength to watch you. I'm merely answering the call to duty all of our royal bloods here. All that I do, I do to be worthy of this throne. I see. How lovely. And do you feel you've accomplished that goal? Do you feel worthy? I'll be blunt. You're sorely lacking. I'm not saying it's wrong to admire others or hold them as an ideal, but you've made yourself a slave to that admiration. You've silenced your own will. Instead of following your own heart, you mindlessly adapted to the of another. A king who is one who stands at the fore of his people, leads them onward. Who would follow one? Who would follow one who only threatens another's path? Indeed, it is as you say. In my adulation of the hero of Beerus, I can't believe that I'm mimicking him with the last king must wed. At least you say, no matter how grand the example, one who does nothing but blindly follow cannot be worthy of the throne. But the same then holds for you. You like the qualification to be king. Excuse me? A king is one who stands at the fall of his people, leads them onward, yet here you stand, alone. Hence, you are no king! As a beard in his day, you fight alone. No ally at his side, no followers behind you. And the followers are the proof of the king's worthiness. If you stand before me now, no more king than I. You were barely standing for much to kill. Where is this power coming from? Hmm. The fact you have to ask is the most damning proof yet of your un unworthiness of the throne. Uh, don't get cocky, well. You have my thanks, imposter. You've let me just have I was meant to thread. Perhaps told about my own ideals. I will strive to be a beast no longer. I need not fight alone. Need only be one, one link in the chain to keep possibility alive. And to do that, I need not follow the footsteps of any other. I must trust in the direction of my own heart steals me. Finally, getting to the same that he needs after being like a, a person in the sideline for so long. Surely, you don't think a petty realization of the office would be enough to turn the tables here. The difference between us is manifestly clear. You're on a match me. Perhaps, but I'll not back down. I thought that this path I thread would give others hope of paving the way to the new promise. The path bends here in sad defeat. There is no hope, no possibility beyond. Ah! Has it sunk in now? False hope and hollow promise cannot change cold hard fact. Now, meet an end is empty and Persec is your prime. Now, our eyes don't walk left. No man, it's not hard, it's lot. Alas, I'm not the noble warrior type like my little brother there. Been watching for a while now, actually. It wasn't a script, but what sort of brother would I be if I denied him to do what he dreamed of? Fairies? You might have stood some chance if we'd come at me together. Ridiculous this consideration has cost you everything. I wonder, because the accident you feels looked far from meaningless to me. He's grown thanks to you, and I've made an important realization myself. What nonsense is this? I made that replica because I wanted to spare Papa to go with the public returns as well. Such was my sincere desire. But in truth, I was just like a brother. I idolized Liberius. Affected by one scale as a child, I grew up fail, helpless. I listened to tales of the great hero and dreamt of being like him. With Alex and I did first that while he sought to embody those ideals himself, I also sought to achieve, uh, achieve them elsewhere. Hmm. <laughs> and? You saw your brother's little epiphany and you decided to join him? Just so. Seeing him break out of the show that held him all these years, I felt it was high time that I did the same. To turn my gaze inside and find my own path forward. As long as we keep faith in our possibilities, that path will never end. That's quite a lovely speech, but Hollow Retorg is just hot air. What you choose to believe in is immaterial. Your brother is proof. Look at them pouring in the dirt. 
this path you speak of is a dead end. No pretty talk of both possibilities can change that reality. Oh, but I can. Well, have you not really asked to, to see you in? What? What is? You may fancy yourself to victor in your duels, my brother. If Alex did not lose. Not with a blow either, that you agree to call. <laughs> if this were a one-on-one -on -one fight, you would surely be the winner. But unlike you, we aren't fighting alone. The blow he spoke was never meant to defeat you alone. It was simply hissling at a chain. No, this isn't. This can't be how it ends. I refuse to accept it. As you say, what you choose to believe won't change reality. You've lost. It's the possibility of Alex secured for us. I haven't lost anything yet! No! Ah! You can't mean to save stuff in that state! Ugh. No! Fairies! Phalanx! Are you all awake? Uh, next to you. I'm glad to see I made it in time for the finale. You caused my surprise the last time. It won't happen twice. And we're not allowed to hurt my family again. Uh, my guy's still on here, so I'll just be hanging back for a meal. You know, after five fight, it was just a little joke. I'll fight you all the right. They keep coming out of the woodwork. So much the better. I went a lot of you. Victory will be mine. You won't. I'm. All of us are going to stop you here and now. You cannot maintain that form as a damaged core. It would turn to dust ere long, even without our help. But we wouldn't let that happen. And they did not allow the sun to set on her upon his pride. <laughs> so there you have it. Apologies, but you'll be spending your final moments with us. The victor hasn't been decided yet. I'll show you the path I tread is no dead end. Let us begin. Time to show the world this family's power surpasses even legends. The future is bleak. Hopeless. <laughs> the decisive battle awaits. I shall protect this world. Sovereign Mirage. Sovereign Barrage. Sovereign Barrage. Going all in. This smoldering flame shall blaze anew. Absolute Dominion! Sovereign Barrage! All together now! Oh dear, your end has come. Sovereign Barrage! Going all in! The time is nigh to show the power of my absolute dominion! My might reigns ever supreme. Now, Alex. <laughs> That's the core. This is the end.
if this is what the beer has become, what my descendants are capable of. I've nothing to feel. Just what is that supposed to mean? You would dare underestimate us, even still? No. I found a black one to leave his body a moment ago. He hasn't caused fighters any longer. He has fear of its corruption now. This is the true of areas. Forgive me, my kin. I forced too much upon you. Well, then I could have ended all of this myself. But alas, I was not able. Iberius! You're amazing, all of you. I certain that together you reach the future I was never able to see myself. You weren't alone. You need to become like I was. But you've already realized that. Yes, I'll seek to be you no longer. Greatest the all, following the footsteps cannot leave me alone, must go. If you would carry on your will, we must forge our own path. What are these beyond even the idea of your pursuit? <laughs> I see. Then I'll leave the rest to you. The rest is up to us, eh? <laughs> Statement of the obvious. Uh, I'm just glad it's finally open. If I don't have to deal with a headache like this again, it will be too soon. What are you talking about? The battle to a sword to pretend it will be far worse than this. No doubt. If just this has you really, I can get better to think of the future. <laughs> Which means we had better get you some intensive training before then. Hey, I'm the Emperor Dino 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 now, now, have you know? Nobody bosses me around. I'm with you. I see. I suppose I best snatch that throne from under you. Oh come on! <laughs> come now, brother, stop with your teasing. I'm beginning to feel sorry for the poor thing. That... that was teasing? He was teasing? The Empire has finally begun to settle down under your rule. Can't you leadership now with only sowed the seeds of unrest? You're doing a fine job, Emil. The rest of us have effectively abandoned you and these people. The Empire was only held together as well as it has since the last Emperor's fall because some was, someone was going to slow. If not for you, Emil, we siblings will likely have been branded cowards who abandoned our kingdoms and fled. We all owe our gratitude for that, so thank you. You are thanking me? Am I... am I dreaming? What, what am I saying? Even my, even my dreams aren't this realistic. Explain this madness, you are fixed like that Iberius, aren't you? All will be saved, you are taking me alive! Emil, please calm yourself. Stop making a scene, fool. They're merely saying we owe you, so we're suspending, suspending our final judgment. For now. But don't know what's cause the border is a threat to our own stability here. I will repeat to you into precisely what is required of a leader and ensure that does not happen. Play yourself for a thorough lesson. Uh, why does it always end like this? And it will be alright, Emil. As all of us working together, we'll overcome any obstacle that stands in our way. <laughs> Your speech? Yes, I suppose, if we all work together. Wait, no! Why should I be made to suffer for less than the beating than work? I'm glad to join you in training. I've always found Coop's test more productive. I like you too, Alex! <laughs> all of us together, lead. I shall have to do my part for now. So I'll be off then. Each of us on a path forward by our own convictions toward the shared future of the new possibility. Nice little end event. There's all seven of the four family members together. Now, if you excuse me, I'm gonna be off the grind all of this event, guys. I only have so much time.